वेलकम बैक टू सिविल इंजीनियर यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस प्रैक्टिकल वीडियो आई विल गाइड यू फॉर स्टील स्ट्रक्चर डिजाइन इन द कंस्ट्रक्शन ऑफ दिस फ्लोर बीम विद आरसीसी स्लेब स्पेशली डिजाइन फॉर थ्री स्टोरी कमर्शियल बिल्डिंग यू कैन सी क्लियरली दिस इज द जंक्शन बिटवीन बीम एंड कॉलम एंड द फ्लोर बीम साइज इज ट्वेल्व बाई सिक्सटीन इंचिस ऑलरेडी प्लेस्ड द स्टील रे इनफोर्समेंट इन साइड द शटरिंग शटरिंग इज रेडी and you can see guys here this is the size 12 by 16 inches width is 12 inches with concrete cover without concrete cover size of the mesh is 9 inches and the depth is 16 inches with slab at 12 by 22 inches this is the tension zone where we have four steel rods and the dia is 16 mm The concrete cover is already provided with the thickness of 25 mm or 1 inch. If you see guys the shutting is open in some joints it should be covered by any method because we have more chances of bleeding from concrete and bleeding is a danger for concrete if it is beam column or slab anyone. The depth is 16 inches width is 12 inches with concrete cover with the thickness of the slab it will be 22 inches depth for this beam four bars at the bottom this is the top portion which is called compression zone where we have three bars total we have seven bars Four at the bottom, three at the top. This is eight millimeter die off stirrup with the spacing of seven inches. Hooks are bent on ninety degree. It should be provided on one thirty five degree. The slab steel reinforcement are placed inside this floor beam. On the other side, this is L by four distance. The spacing you can see guys clearly, which is four inches here. This is extra side bars. Provided only at the distance of L by four. After L by four, we don't have these two side bars, and the dia is sixteen millimeter. At the distance of L by four, we have nine bars. After L by four, in the section BB, we have seven bars. On the other side, guys, you can see the spacing of main bars and distribution bars are four by four to seven inches. Seven after L by four. at the distance of l by 4 this is 4 inches or you can say 100 mm guys you can see here the spacing is increase up to 7 inches because at the distance of l by 4 we are providing extra steel rods also bent up bar also the spacing should be closed because we have more chances of cracks because we have negative bending moment on both directions if the length is maximum so provide l by 4 L by three. If the spacing is minimum, so provide L by four. Already they provided sanitary pipe inside this column, so this is one of the big mistake. They should not provide because it can make minimum volume of concrete because this is a hole from the top to the bottom of this column. Guys, you can see the spacing is six by six inches for main bars and distribution bars in the construction of this slab. they provided lapping at the middle of this floor beam so the lapping is allowed to provide at the middle of the floor beam but at the top portion which is called compression zone not at the tension zone which is bottom portion guys you can see the span is here 30 feet but they provided lapping at the middle l by 2 so this is okay but it's not allowed at the bottom which is called tension zone you can see guys concrete cover is provided with the thickness of 25 mm it's okay 1 inch concrete cover at the bottom one at the top you can see the spacing is 6 by 6 inches they provided singly mesh On the other side guys we have open to sky this is open to sky the size is 4 by 12 inches 
you can see because this is commercial building and they provided lip they provided open to sky there they will not place the concrete inside this brick masonry place thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye